Brothers, for those of you who are watching these Sowing the Faith videos, if you want to be notified every time I post something new, you can subscribe to my channel, click on the notification bell, give a thumbs up and like the video, because you certainly will be greatly blessed. May the Lord God bless you. My friends, in John 8, 34, Jesus said the following, it's a lesson for you and for me, so that we'll never sin, folks. And if we sin, we should instantly ask God to forgive us. Jesus answered them, Most assuredly, I say to you, whoever commits sin is a slave of sin. Brethren, this is so serious. If I take something away from someone, if I do something wrong against someone, then I sin. So because of that, I committed a sin, but it's not something I own. It actually owns me. From that moment on, it can determine things. You will have this sickness. You will have this failure. You will have this accident. We have to rebuke that in the name of Jesus. Rebuke it, brethren. Rebuke it because if you sinned, then confess it to God so that sin will leave you. Sin can't be in you, not even for a minute, or you will be a slave to sin. And when sin is in your life, it's merciless, it's evil, and it's malignant. Take a look at a person who was blessed. What was wrong with your ear, I sister? I could barely hear from this, this ear, ear. Your left ear. Yes, this, this one was here. a good one. Yes. But if you shut this ear, then you couldn't hear anything. No, I could barely hear. I see. So come over here, sister. Shut this ear now. Maria. Antonia. João. Four. Now I want to pray for you. Father, forgive these people who have sinned, who had no idea they were a slave to sin. Oh my Lord, how many times in my services I have dozens of people who are a slave to sin. Give me the anointing to make these people stop being a slave to sin and become a servant of God. I will bless these people now. Lord, all evil get out of these lives now. That's an order. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen.